I have my car here, packing everything, and just getting ready to to go. I want to say it is like 8.50, I'm about to get on the road. Uh, I'm just going to pack my car up. So, it is... 8.55 a.m. and I'm about to get on the road. I'm gonna drive about maybe three hours before I get to a charging point. So a little backstory, I have an electric vehicle and I got a lease. I wanna change my lifestyle and I wanna change like my goals and endeavors. So I decided to get rid of my lease and one of my good friends was like, I'll take over it. So I'm like, okay, cool. So she asked me to drop off the car, which is in LA. So that's what we're going on this road trip for. I am gonna drive an electric vehicle all the way to LA. And right now it has 279 miles and to LA, I think it's like 350. So I'm gonna have to stop at least twice in order to get there. And then we have 9,310 miles already on this car. Um, so right now we're at 279, it is 8.56 a.m. and I'm gonna start heading on the road. I'm about to play a little podcast or maybe some music, I don't know yet. So let's go on and play some music. As you can see, my destination is 363. I was a little off earlier, but we are estimated to arrive at 216. Let's see realistically what time we arrive well, we're gonna be yeah. listening to it's, la plática and one. hearing karen's yeah. wedding well, regrets i'm excited for this uh we have arrived to charge the car i need to be so bad and grab some food there is a mcdonald's across the street so i'm gonna walk over there and grab food and probably work a little bit because i think it's gonna take about 45 minutes for the car to reload but let me go charge it and let's see how long it actually takes we've got 76 miles left and we have a total of 9487 miles now we're gonna charge the car I finally got my food I was so hungry by the way this is my McDonald's order I'm doing a voiceover because I didn't realize that I wasn't recording in regular mode. I was actually recording in slow motion. And when I record in slow motion in my camera, it doesn't record any audio. I'm also learning how to use my camera still because I literally just got it the day before. So bear with me, but I think that doing this whole vlog really showed me what to do and what not to do with my new camera. But here I'm sharing with you my cookie story. Like, oh my God, pretty girl privileges, I swear. So I ordered two pair of cookies and I didn't get them. And when I went back, the guy was like, yeah, sure. Like I'll give them to you. And he gave me half a dozen instead. I was like, oh my God, thank you. I'm also sharing with you how much I spent charging my car for the 45 minutes. I spent a total of $18 and 81 cents. And I also share with you the app that I use to plan my trip. And what I mean planning is I planned my stops and that way I knew when I was going to stop and I wasn't going to be stranded in the middle of the desert with no charge on my vehicle. So thankfully I planned accordingly. I'm a huge planner for things like this. And if you're interested in the app, I'll link it down below somewhere. So next stop is gonna be Bakersfield. We're gonna drive there. I think it's gonna take us about two hours. I got this coffee at McDonald's that was mediocre at best. It was a caramel macchiato, never getting that again. But I'm gonna eat my cookies on the way. See you in Bakersfield. We made it to Bakersfield. Um, I'm just in my car editing a YouTube video. This is the video of how much I spent starting up my lash business when i got here i went to the restroom i had to go take a shit really really bad but yeah i've just kind of been chilling here i'm gonna show you kind of what i'm doing so just here waiting at the station i still have 45 minutes to go um but yeah here is kind of like other cars charging and it is hot in my car but i kind of have the door cracked open i close it right now because i'm recording this little segment just my dongle got disconnected and look almost lost all my footage i hope that um i can recuperate it oh my god it is hot in here 
Okay, I think my car is fully charged. Let's go take a look at it. Hi. Hi. Excuse me. No, that's her car. This car, blue one. Excuse me. Oh, this are is you my car. This is yours? Yes. Oh, are you done? Yeah, I'm just. Oh, so this is how much it charged. And I'm about to unplug it because it just finished charging. All right. Off we go. We have 244 miles and we've ranked up 9,606 miles. Remember what we started with? And here we go on the road again. Woohoo! We're going through the grapevines these are like so pretty you guys i'm only about 67 minutes away from la and i can't wait to get there so yeah um i'll see you guys in la when i see my bestie made it to LA. I just arrived to my best friend's house. Look how pretty her home is. It's so pretty. It looks like a little jungle here. Um, I'm obsessed. Her place is so, so cute. But yeah, I made it home. Oh, I made it to her house nice and safe. I'm gonna get ready, shower, and then we're gonna go down to dinner and I'll take you guys with me. Um, we are gonna go to like this underground like wine bar i think it's some type of underground bar in pasadena so i'm super excited and i'm gonna shower wash my hair because i feel so stinky and just sweaty but yeah i'll see you guys later we are ready for dinner this is my foot check i'm wearing all of danielle's clothes because clearly i didn't bring an outfit for tonight we decided we're gonna go to the Cheesecake Factory, by the way. Dee, are you excited to go to the Cheesecake Factory? I can't wait. Look how cute, bestie. You guys, she's adorable. Hi. Only in LA. What is happening here? But do you guys see that up there? Him. Guys, look. What is that up there? I can't tell. Oh, it... Ah, look. The guy's right there. Projecting that. People do that here in LA. That's wild. Can anybody guess where we're at? She is looking at the moon. Like, I mean, I know you guys can't see it, but look how pretty it looks. It's gorgeous. Oh, I wish you guys could see it. But yeah, that's what my friend is doing here, taking a picture of the moon. Let's see, what did you get? Oh, so pretty. <laughs> you happy, D? <laughs> I'm so excited to eat, so let's go ahead and have it. I just got out of bed. It is, ooh, I do not know what time it is. It'll, oh, it's 7.44 a.m. I'm gonna show you guys. It's 7.44, oh shit. I don't know if you guys can see, but it's 7.44 a.m. Yeah, it's 7.44 a.m. Um, I'm gonna charge my like equipment and stuff and start getting ready. Last night, you guys, I ate so much food, like so much. I feel so bloated right now and just, ugh. I did I eat so much. I also drank way so much, so I'm just like, uh. But I did overnight curls, and I don't know if you guys are interested in seeing them. I just use this sock method where I put two socks on each side, and then, let me see if I can take them out. <laughs> um, I just don't wanna be walking around with my head like this. My tummy kinda hurts. so curly and bouncy. Mm. Yeah. What do you guys think? It looks nice. Love how curly and bouncy it turned out. Alright, so I'm gonna charge my equipment and I'll show you guys everything that I brought for my trip. So this is my section here that I kind of just took over. So of course I brought my laptop. I brought my Polaroid because I just wanted to have a Polaroid with me to take pictures with. 
I'm gonna charge it here. So, laptop case. Inside of my laptop case, I brought a hard drive. I need this for editing. I brought a dongle, because you know the computer I have doesn't take USB and stuff, so I need that. I brought extra accessories like for my stuff. Um, in this baggie, I have like the chargers, loop for a USB connector, and the stand for the tripod for the phone. That I brought the charger for my other camera, which is for my old camera. So if you guys didn't know, I just purchased a new camera, but this was my old camera. It was a Canon GX7 um, 1, basically, like the first, first ever edition. I added this extra lens to it. It's a wide angle lens, wide macro angle lens, something like that. Um, I got it off of Amazon, and this works great. I love the like flash photography with this, but I needed an upgrade for my videos because I wanted better quality, so I did. I actually need to buy a lens for the current camera I have. And then I brought this other baggie with like another cube and another charger because I need chargers like constantly. I have a little cloth to wipe down the lens. And then lens cleaners. These are important. I personally just love having those in my kit. I think I want to condense one bag for like... I always travel with a vape pen. I just, I have anxiety, so it helps. AirPods, these are a must. I also brought my audio equipment. Um, I'll be adding a mic later to my filming setup. But this is, this is my, my, my mic stuff. Um, these are little like this. I actually should charge that. This is just a USB thing. Okay, so I'm gonna show you what else I brought. So this is a little backpack I have. Um, this is like my filming equipment backpack. It's a little Kipling bag. I'm obsessed with this monkey. And I love it because it has a lot of storage. Oh, I have more Polaroid film for my Polaroid. And this is the Polaroid I took last night. Isn't it so cute? Me in front of the freeway. I just, my friend took it and I thought it was adorable. Last thing on my item. This item is so cool. It's a charging case for your batteries. And this is my original Sony battery. And this is like an extra backup battery. And you can turn it on here and it tells you how much battery each battery has. Oh, it doesn't pop up. You can see it tells you like on here, out of camera, it tells you it's actually on camera, but it shows differently here. Remember I said I was staying at my friend's house? Um, I slept, she, she had to go somewhere, so I slept in her bed. And I'm just gonna pick up my area before I leave. Um, my camera died earlier, but I charged it and I have two other batteries so that way it doesn't happen again But I want to show you a quick little outfit check. I am ready to head out I'm actually gonna go pick up my sister because she's gonna be my videographer for the day a little quick outfit check Cute 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 I'm excited no, I know the lighting's not the greatest here, but I'm um, working with what I have. But I'm gonna go pick up my little sister from college. I am so excited because I've never gone to her school and I think it's just gonna be a little cute experience. <laughs> Today we're doing a photo shoot for one of my brands called Loda Toilet Spray. So I'm picking up some snacks and drinks at Whole Foods um, because I need them for our photographer and our models and stuff like that. I cannot take my camera into Whole Foods. Well, I can't, I just don't want to, but I'll show you guys what I get in a bit.
When in LA, the craziest shit happens. There's a fire going on right now. And oh my God, I'm gonna be stuck here. Look at that fire. Do you guys see that smoke? It is so crazy. <gasps> Only in LA, this shit happens. <laughs> oh fuck, let me try to get out of here. Oh God, I don't know what's burning. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> oh my God, everything I've seen here. I don't see this stuff in the Bay Area, you guys. This is wild. I'm looking horrible. I just picked up my baby sister from school. Yay. Oh, I'm so excited to see you. Okay, let's um head down to downtown to the studio where Let's head down to downtown to the studio where we're going to go shoot at. I need to input the address, so yeah, here, hold it. Little um, Cynthia takeover. I'm at my school. Can I show my school? <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of construction right now. Okay. Let's Dude, there was a massive ass fire. Really? Where? Yeah. Um, on the freeway really coming nice over building. here. You can I'm flip the camera around. This. Can you see my pores? I have pores. How do I stop filming? Right here with this one. <sighs> Finally. It took forever to find parking. I can't even like find um what is it called? We need to go find the studio because yeah. I don't know where it's at. <laughs> I also need to put um, audio on it. Oh, okay, okay. You didn't connect the thing. Can you hold my water bottle? Uh, yeah. Or is that too much? No, no, that's fine. You sure? Yeah. there for a second so we're trying to find the entrance I think we have to go around this entire building I think the view from up there would be really nice the sky was super nice gave us instructions on how to get there what did he tell you?
Yay! Hey, it's me again so for those of you who don't know I own a toilet disinfecting spray it's a two-in-one formula that helps sanitize and utilize the restroom after you go number two and today we're hosting a photo shoot for our product because we're launching about two new scents one is called cucumber and the other one is called bergamot and i am so excited so here we got to the studio that we rented out for around four hours and i found this place off of pier space and the host was super incredible incredibly nice um the studio itself was so pretty and gorgeous it was a little bit difficult to access but we found our way through and we're just here setting up doing hair and makeup and just kind of hanging out for a few hours and i just wanted to show you guys bring you guys along and just see the experience i hope you guys enjoy this Toddy's eating. He's so hungry. <laughs> what are you most excited about, Toddy? Can't wait to see how these pictures turn out. The photographer is going to do the makeup. They're going to be for our website. Yeah. Um, right now, we're having hair and makeup going on right now. Joel is taking product photography. Yeah. My little sister's behind the camera filming me and making sure. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, somebody's talking to the door. I'm coming. Like I know it's just, it feels like work. So I want to. Sorry, you can't come in. <laughs> Sorry, I have a. It's Danielle. Yeah. If you made it this far into my vlog, thank you so much. I love you and thank you for your time. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Leave me a little cherry emoji down below letting me know that you like this type of content so I can create more vlogs for you and, you know, just share a little bit more of my life. Thanks. Yes, yeah. everyone's so friendly. It's my first time modeling and you're doing like I've been really doing good. It forever. Literally gorgeous. 
A couple fun facts about how we hosted this photo shoot and how we kept it under $600. So we are on a tight budget, we are a startup company, so we literally asked our family and friends, the videographer is my baby sister, she didn't charge me a thing, and then the two models, one of them is my best friend and the other one is my business partner's friend, and they literally just came to help us they didn't charge us a thing i did take my best friend to dinner in returns you know that's i think something nice and then the photographer he was a friend of my boyfriend so super affordable and then the place the studio we actually found it on pier space and we only paid 200 dollars for four hours that we rented it out so in total i spent i believe under 600 dollars and you know i think for our budget that was great because we inquired a photographer that we really wanted and that person was charging us over $500 just for the photo shoot and we were like oh my god no that's that's a little too expensive so if you are on a budget ask your family and friends to help you out literally that's what we did and everything turned out so amazing our photographer was phenomenal I would definitely be using him again in the future he was just so easy to work with and the photography came out Stunning. wrap for the photo shoot afterwards i went to go turn in my car and said goodbye to it and then headed to my mom's house and my little sister here staring at me asking me what i'm doing and i was literally just recording us kind of hanging out and i just cherish these moments so much because i don't get to see my siblings that often but this night i just kind of reviewed all the footage that i took for the day and hung out with the girls and just enjoyed quality time with my sisters and I'm just here sharing what I'm doing and my sister was complaining about the Wi-Fi. So Good morning! Corelli's over here. My baby sister is taking me to the airport today. Uh, I'm headed home and guess what you guys? I hit 500 subscribers today. It was one of my goals for September and I'm so proud of myself. Two days ago I checked and I was at 496 and this morning I checked and I'm at 505 so I'm beyond grateful and thank you so much for the 500 subscribers.